Concerning the uh, Greek ecosystem, startup ecosystem. Marius will uh, give you some more explanation concerning Dimitris and Eric. Dimitris and Eric will uh, speak about themselves. I just want to propose uh, to make a round, like to pass through all of us and uh, say who is who, just to know the audience. I'm a software integrator. It's not just software, it's a chat bots. But of course, we, we do create a business connection, so that's why I'm here. So I'm, I'm in charge for software portfolio. Uh, co founder of Smart City Education Initiative uh, in Serbia. Of Smart Technological Park, that you're very interested Quite a few young people trying to better understand what this startup ecosystem means and how they can be part of uh, this, this new movement. Uh, th there are a few financial instruments, correct me if I'm wrong, um, available. Uh, in the Serbian market for Serbian, Serbian entrepreneurs. It seems that uh, in a premature uh, phases, like what we call pre-seed, so the very first money a company will eventually need to uh, build a product or, or uh, to, to finalize a minimum uh, viable uh, edition of, of their solution they are bidding. It, financial support is not really there. Uh, We've seen a couple of uh, great initiatives in terms of incubation acceleration services here in Belgrade. We met with Started uh, last night and Impact Hub um, here in, in Belgrade. Where we come from, it, it, it seems that the only difference we have is that there is a new generation of venture capital activity focused in the ICT sector. Exactly. Uh, we, st we stand at the very bottom of the equation, we are part of uh, the innovation acceleration stage. So we're partners at Velocity Partners, one of these funds, as the just said. We're here to say a few things about uh, our fund, but more importantly, I think we're here for two reasons. One is um, to have a conversation afterwards where we can tell you where we've been, what our experiences have been. Obviously, we have differences in that. For example, you're not part of the EU. Uh, on the other hand, you did not have the kind of crisis we had over the last few years. Um, nevertheless, there's similarities that are much more uh, intense. And, and you can see, for example, the fact that you're from the Prime Minister's office is here. You're seeing that a lot of uh, the, the basics you need to solve have to do with the logistics of the issue. We were talking to Impact Hab yesterday, and they told us how they had to do this whole convoluted scheme to do the first convertible note, which had to do completely with the framework as far as legal is concerned. So these little things that we can talk and discuss and see how you can maybe do some shortcuts. 